Neil Patterson from Sky News. Um, the first question, two of the three uh, most recent cases come in pretty uh, densely populated areas, South East London and Birmingham. How will that uh, be informing your strategy? And uh, on a second point, kind of slightly relating to the, to the child, uh, the school that's been closed, um, I mean, at what stage will we see um, indiv- people being asked not to congregate in, in large groups, either at schools, tube stations, uh, football stadium and the like? I'll ask Liam to comment in a second, but actually high levels of population like Birmingham uh, and London, the procedure is the same. We're at a stage now where when there is an outbreak of swine flu, we seek to isolate it to ensure that the people who have had contact with the individual concerned are given antivirals as a prophylactic, as a preventative uh, measure. Uh, uh, and that's the same procedure whether it's in Paynton in Devon or whether it's in South East London. On the issue of mass gatherings, we're not anywhere near the stage yet, although we're talking in government at COBRA about uh, preparing for that. So our philosophy here has to be uh, hope for the best, uh, but absolutely prepare for the worst. So on mass gatherings, there is a level that we will get to that's quite clear in the framework that we've already published and set up, where we will have to look at that, but we're not at that stage and nowhere near that stage at the moment. 